There is just so much you can do with this double opener. So, watch this video until the end to learn all the tricks that will make you what? A super bartender, that's right. And yes, you guessed it right. Of course, uh, we're going to give it away for a random comment like we usually do. By the way, congratulations to Alfonso Cruz for winning the shaker. So let's try who's gonna win this one. As you already probably figured by its shape that uh, it can perfectly open two bottles. Let's say compared to the V-Rod that I was always showing to you in the video. Make sure to watch all the previous video that I showed to you. So we usually do like this, pam pam, or just like open one, two. And with this one, so you just uh, also put, let's say two in two bottles, and then you can just boom, boom, open two. So you see, it's perfect. Also on the other side, it has this uh, thing that uh, can perfectly help you to pull out poor spots from empty bottles. Boop. I actually don't know how different they are, but look, this is completely different. Let's try both how uh, they work. Put it all away. Okay, it's pretty simple. And now let's try the double one. I'm pretty sure it should work the same. Okay. Yeah, it's the same, but I like it a little bit better when it's shaped like this because it kind of feels like it, it goes in easier than when it's a shape of the triangle. But it's all the basics, right? So of course you've seen all this before. And how about this one? For example, if you have shaker and there's ice, for some reason you don't have strainer, check it out. You just place it right here on top and slide it a little bit lower and it's automatically becoming a strainer. Boom. Whoop. Of course you still can do all the balances that we learned with you before. Boom. <laughs> and it actually feels so much safer to do tricks uh, because, for example, look, this part is so much wider than uh, this one. Yeah, this is the comparison for you. And for example, tricks like remember the crazy ones where we learned with you how to flip the glass like this one. Look, the glass like stays there so perfectly compared to the regular opener. Woo! This one, I mean, I can do it, but it's just a who goes left and right, so much harder. Let me try with this one, because I know we've done this one before. It was a little bit challenging. Bottle first, cold glass. <laughs> done deal. Coronavirus. Let's go to the next one. If you would like to open bottle with that, remember how we use shaker and did this. But you don't want to damage this uh, really nice sexy shaker, link in the description, so guys check them out. With this opener, it, of course you prefer to open this way, it's just such a perfect grip when you hold it this way. So let me try and see if it's going to make similar sound. Oh, <laughs> Make sure you guys subscribe to this channel and don't forget to hit the like button. Okay, now let's try to open it, remember, with that slide, Boop, like we did uh, with this opener. Hopefully, with this one will be easier. Remember, it's just really easy. You need to hold it in this position and then just like keep sliding until it uh, touches cap. And then just keep going. Let's try. Cheers. Ooh. I've been told that's what I should do not to get coronavirus. I also wanted to show you too how easily you can do this trick like a saber, but uh, we bought wrong champagne, so. But we're just gonna show it to you even better trick. So of course, you're not gonna be always opening beer bottles. For example, if you will have soda. Let me show it to you first, let me break it down. If you, for example, making a highball. So you have your ice, you have everything, and, uh, oh, by the way, woo! This is the breakdown. It's more like to impress a guest and maybe even judges at a competition. So a really cool trick. Uh, you need to just hold, let me show it to you with, with the empty bottle. You place jigger, it could be small jigger or the bigger one, doesn't matter. On top of your opener like this and practice a few times. Poo! This move, catch it with left hand and catch it with right hand. I'm not sure if you can see me. Sorry, I had a few bottles of beer before. So, boom. Boom. And then let's say this is your soda water and then just this is how you should grab it. Like um, between index and thumb your soda bottle. You do like, oh wait, what's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? And you just uh, place jigger right here and just like with the glass trick, boop, 
you open it and place it on top of the your spirit, maybe gin or vodka, and on the then do the pour. Two ounces. This bottle's already open, and then you just pour and pour soda. Pretty cool, right? But now let me try to do it actually with the very last bottle of tonic. Let's go. You get it, right? So, and if you notice, I totally forgot to mention that when I caught it. I caught it in my right hand and then I started spinning so and I cover it pool spot with the jigger. I mean ideally it would be kind of cool if you will be able to do it like when you just uh, open it that it would perfectly <laughs> fall on top of it but it's really hard. I mean let me know in the comments if any of you will be trying this kind of things. I would just recommend to go easy way just because it's already not so easy and then uh, catch it with the same hand like this and then cover it. All right now try and with the real bottle I promise. Okay, making a uh, vodka tonic this time for real. You take bottle, palm, and then place it upside down. And they're like, oh, wait, what she's gonna do? What she's gonna do? So. We don't even have fresh lime right now, so I'm just gonna drink it like this. Thank you so much guys for watching this episode and don't forget to check out uh, links in the description to the store where you can get all kind of openers. Woo! I know it's been a while but I promise that new video coming to okay hold my camera. I have so many ideas I just need a little bit more time to execute it so if you haven't subscribed yet please go see that channel. It's the best channel on YouTube. And of course don't forget to leave a random absolutely random comment you know we're gonna use this app that uh, choose one of the winners <laughs> so this opener will be going somewhere around the world so we're just gonna give it away leave anything so go comment right now and very last thing before you go uh, don't forget to check out my stories on Instagram I post really cool stuff from Miami and Las Vegas so follow me on Insta and I'll see you in the next video